YouTube. Today is an um, uh, um, oh right, an occasion to celebrate. I've bought something modern because my other thing that was modern is now under the bench. Let's see if I can do anything with my diehard charger died too easily, and after I've been to the junkyard so many times picking up old batteries out of the tractors. I had an idea. Why don't I go up and pick up one of these new battery miner desulfators? See if they really work. I'm bringing them up to charge at this old tender that my grandfather had. I think it's been around for about 10, 12 years now. Oh, God, more, come to think of it. I can get hooked up to this old X side, which also just happens to be the identical twin of that strong box. And man, those two are heavy compared to normal batteries. Um, this one I've started the 11 horse cube with oh wait I should have said that but um future special um, I started it once right now I'm bringing up the charge of the tender I mean I think the output's actually less on the tender than it is on the desulfator but oh well I just got hooked up with this old overly priced um automotive battery that was in my bowlings until the tractor blew up but so we're gonna give it a shot I mean all the, the newest battery here is 11, and the oldest one here is uh, 1996, I believe the date is on it. The tag rat rubbed off in the rain, but it's just that one right there, the first one. Uh, I think I got that one to take a charge as well. I've been running them up with this um, little tender for a while, but now I don't really see if these desulfators work. There's a few people talking about them on the internet, but... Every single one seems a little varied in their results or how they even explain if it worked at all. So this is going to be my test. I mean, hey, haven't I got enough batteries to try? And there's more. There's already tractors in the... There's already... Yeah. There's already batteries in the other tractors that I haven't shown yet. So yeah, we got a little bit of a work in progress. I know they take a long time to properly do. I hear it takes months to properly do it, but... I've heard people say connect them up for seven days or so and they come back. So I mean... For the price of the charger, if I can get one or two of them even just to come back, I mean, that's not bad. Every one of these batteries has been sitting for more than five, six years. And one of them, almost 12, I think. Whatever one came out of the cube, I forget. So, it looks like I'm actually going to try and do something a little modern for a change, would you ever believe it? I will say, though, these things are a little, um confusing in the way they work. I believe she's charging, she's flashing, and if it's solid, it's maintained. I can't quite tell, but I literally just had this one saying the battery was fully charged, and now it's been charging for almost 20 minutes. So, I don't know. I get confused with this stuff so damn easy. But, well, I guess what have I got to lose? They say they guarantee it won't overcharge or money back or whatever the hell it said on the box, so... I'm holding them to it. <laughs> so, looks like we have um, something modern to experiment with for a change. Ought to be interesting, so there we have it. A battery minder 1500 with a desulfator and smart technology. That's how you're supposed to pronounce it. <laughs> anyway, not all the old stuff's gone just yet. So, that's all for now, YouTube. Bye all.